Hi guys, happy Wednesday and welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of the Publix about to head in here and check out some deals. I'm gonna walk you through the deals in the store, plus I'll have a printable list below the video so you can print that out, take it to the store with you and it's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy. So depending on your area, your deals at Publix may start on Wednesday or they may start on Thursday. So this might give you a head start to the deals or you might be ready to go ahead and head to the store today so definitely let me know in the comments below if you're gonna be shopping today or later in the week if you're working on any kind of bonuses or anything for Ibotta I don't have any Ibotta bonus I'm working on right now but one may pop up a little later in the week but if you are completely new to my channel welcome thank you so much for being here and if you enjoy the video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up as well as hit that red subscribe button below and the notification bell so you don't miss any new ones Let's go ahead in here, let's check out these deals, and then we're gonna go over the receipt once we get done and talk final cost of everything we're picking up today. Plus, I forgot to mention, it is a gas card week. That can vary by area. Last time they did the promotion, my area didn't have it, but this time we do, and I'm super excited about that because when you pick up $50 worth of groceries and you purchase a $50 gas card, you're gonna get $10 off your purchase. So let's go ahead and see what we can pick up. All right, guys, first up we have the Post Pebbles Shake Up. So we have not tried these yet. They're $4.99, buy one, get one free. We have a $1.50 digital coupon. So you could get two of these for $3.49. Or if you live in Half Bogo, you can buy one for $2.49, use the $1.50 digital, and it'll make it just 99 cents. Next up, we are going to grab some of this pancake mix. You can get the syrup or the pancake mix. These are $3.39 here at my store. We are actually going to go ahead and use a $1 digital coupon. Now, I'm going to pick up just one of these. It's going to make it $0.69 cents for me because I live in Half Bogo. If you have to purchase two, it would be $2.39 after the coupon. Next, we're going to grab some of the Fruity Pebbles and the Cocoa Pebbles. So, no coupons on this, but they're buy one, get one free. My kids love this cereal. I kind of like the Cocoa Pebbles myself. So, I'm going to go ahead and pick these up for $3.08 for two boxes. Next, we're going to grab another cereal deal. This one, we have a digital coupon. So, you can grab the General Mills cereal. They're $3.87. With your dollar off two digital coupon, you're gonna pay just $2.87. Check it out, it's got coupons on the back of some of the boxes, so you can use those on one of your next purchases. Next, I'm gonna grab some of the Body Armor drinks. They're on sale this week for four for $5. My husband likes that Body Armor Edge, and I found these $1 hang tag coupons. So check around here at Publix and also over at Walmart, see if you can find these. They are $1 off of two. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use two of these. It's gonna make four of these just $3. So that's gonna be a really awesome deal. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab the four. I also wanted to show you guys we have hang tags also on the six pack so if you need to purchase any of these maybe later on keep an eye out for that dollar off the six pack coupon as well next we're going to grab some of the college in broth so this is a great one to have on hand depending on what you're cooking so they're buy one get one free for $2.99 no coupons but i'm going to go ahead and pick this up if you need to pick up some veggies, we've got the green giant vegetables. The four packs are buy one get one free at $5.69. So that means that you would get eight cans for $5.69. Not too bad of a deal. Right now, I'm pretty stocked up on canned food in my pantry, so I'm not going to pick these up. So another item I'm well stocked on right now is spaghetti sauce. So I'm not going to pick this up, but if you need this, this is a great deal. So these are 204 buy one, get one free. Not these large jars. That was in the wrong spot. These up here. So we have 50 cent coupons and our 313 save insert. Use two of those and you'll pay just a dollar and four cents for both jars. So Chloe loves pizza rolls and it's been a while since I bought any. So I'm going to grab these this week. They're buy one get one free at $4.89. I think they come with like 50 in a bag. So you're getting a hundred of them. So that's a pretty good deal. They also have some other items, but I'm going to go ahead and just pick up the bags today. 
so I don't know about you guys, but I love me some popcorn shrimp. So we're going to pick up the Gorton's popcorn shrimp. There's lots of other ones here to choose from as well if you don't want that. But they are $8.79. So we are going to pay $8.79 in the store. But you're going to submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on each of these. It'll make it just $6.79 for both boxes. So not too bad. A good quick dinner one night. Or if you like to eat these for lunch, I do that sometimes when I'm just chilling out the house myself. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and fix me some popcorn shrimp. So I was going to pick up the Pragers, you guys, but they have raised the price. So let me know if your price has gone up. $5.79, buy one, get one free. Now we have a $2 PDF coupon I'll have linked below. So that would make it $1.79 for two. That's not horrible, but they're normally $4.99. And then this these two coupons would make it $0.99 cents for two. So I'm not going to grab them today, but if you like those, it's still not a bad deal. Next, we're going to pick up the Borden cheese. So let me know if you've tried their cheese slices. We've not tried these before, but they're $3.99. We have a couple of coupons. So I printed this dollar off coupon. It's off of any one Borden dairy product. And I'll have that link below the video. So we're going to use those two coupons. We're also going to use a store coupon for $0.55 cents off of one. So you're going to go ahead and clip two of those out of the extra savings booklet. So that'll get us down to just $0.89 cents for both packs of cheese, which which is an amazing, amazing deal. So I'm definitely going to go ahead and grab these. So if you need some eggs, we've got these Nest Fresh free range eggs for $2.99 this week, normally $4.99. And if you look around, a lot of just the regular carton of eggs are around that $2 or almost $3 mark. So that's not a bad deal for those. Next, I'm going to pick up some yogurt because I got myself some granola the other day and forgot to pick up yogurt. So these right here, they are $5.89. Buy one, get one free. But I'm going to pick up one for $2.94 since my area does do the half BOGO. Always keep an eye out for orange tags over at Publix because check this out. We've got some always maxi pads, $1.99. We've also got this one right here and it is the ultra thin uh, for $1.99 as well. So I already got my April P&G coupons and I've never tried to use one of the coupons early before. So I don't know if they work earlier than the day they come out, which these come out on Sunday, but I'm going to try to use a dollar off coupon. It would make it 99 cents. So my store put more of the Thermacare on clearance. They're $3.74 and we have a $2 offer on the coupons.com app. It would make it $1.74. I love these things, so I'm definitely picking these up. I think I have a paper coupon, so I'm going to check and see. All right, guys, so I found my $2 printable coupon, so I'm going to grab another box of these. I'll use a paper coupon on one and then claim the other one to the coupons.com app. This one says it has a bonus free wrap in it, so I'm going to grab this. All right, guys, so next we're grabbing the Springer Mountain Chicken. So I signed up on their website to see if they had any coupons, but they didn't send me anything yet. I'm going to only grab one bag for $2.39 since I live in Half Bogo, but if you're grabbing two, you can get two bags for $4.79. We also have some bacon down here for $5.99, which is a little cheaper than what it has been lately with all these price hikes. So definitely um, check that out if you want to pick up some bacon this week. So if you're doing the gas card deal, you can go ahead and grab a $50 gas card depending on what gas station you want to pick it up for. I'm going to go ahead and grab the Speedway. That's just the most convenient for me. So on here, you're going to clip out this coupon. Oh, my ad flipped upside down. Um, so it's $10 off of your $50 gas card with a grocery purchase of $50 or more. And it doesn't have to all be food items either. All right, guys, so this is how my cart is looking so far. We're about to head over to self-checkout. We'll go over the receipt once I get done and talk final cost. But we have a little over $50 worth of products right here, so we should be good to go for that gas card promotion. So I'm actually going to grab one more item. So I forgot to pick these up at Walmart yesterday, so they're definitely a little higher here at $2.99. But I use these for Chloe's bottle of water for school every day. So I'm going to go ahead and grab them because I'm not going back to Walmart, you guys, for one item. So that's going to cost me a little more today, but I'm going to go ahead and add it into my haul. Here is our total before the gas card and before any coupons. I'm going to go ahead and scan the gas card and then she's going to come over and approve that as well as the coupon. All right, guys, so now we're scanning our other coupons now that she went ahead and approved that. 
So anytime you have like the gas card promotion if you're at self-checkout, they just come over, verify the amount, and then they go ahead and type that in. So if you have a store coupon, you just type in the little code here like you would a fruit or a vegetable. So I have two of those Borden coupons, so I've got to type those in. And then we've only got a couple of other paper coupons today, not a ton. We've got a couple of digitals, not even using a ton of coupons today for our products, but getting a good bit of savings. Let me go ahead and put that in there. You have to wiggle these coupons around for it to <laughs> know that you put one in there. So there is our body armor coupons. I saved the ones for last that I thought I might have an issue with that always when I'm saving it for last since it doesn't come out till Sunday. We'll see what happens with it. We got our boarding coupons. Okay, that one beeped you guys. So we're gonna set that aside and hopefully they can put that through. Oh, and our always coupon scan just fine, so that's awesome. All right, guys, this is our total, including the gift card, including tax, and you can see all our digital coupons. All right, guys, so we are back in the car from Publix. The only coupon beep we had was just that Borden dairy coupon. Other than that, everything else scanned in just fine. So we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna head home, look over the final cost of all of our items. I think it turned out pretty well, especially considering I was grabbing a few items that maybe I wouldn't normally grab with my coupon haul, but wanted to go ahead and pick them up. So let's go ahead, let's go over the receipt and see what our final cost is for everything we picked up today. All right, guys, before we go over my receipt, I want to tell you guys about these coupons. So you can go on the site tastyrewards.com and you can choose up to 10 coupons that they are going to mail to you guys. So it says that you can do that twice per month and check out some of the options. I think it's super awesome. It's completely free to sign up. I got an email about it yesterday, so I was really excited. I selected my coupons and it said that they'll be to me in about a week. So I'll definitely let you guys know when I receive them in the mail but I thought that was an awesome deal. All right guys so I am back home and this is my Publix haul for this week so I'm gonna go ahead and go over my receipt with you guys talk final cost. So I got several sale items only used a couple of paper coupons and then had a couple of digitals and only a little bit of the rebates. So we're gonna go ahead and look over this receipt. I think it turned out really well because all of this right here that you see would have cost me $93.98 before the sale prices, before the coupons, before the rebates, any of that, and that's not including the gas card. So before I scanned in the gas card, my total was $54.62 plus tax. So that means that the sales prices saved me quite a bit already, but then we saved even more with our coupon. So let's go ahead and let's look over this receipt. So you can see all of our items right here. I'm gonna kind of just go down so you guys can see all of those. Then down here at the bottom, you can see the gas card. You can see my coupons. So all of the coupons, like I said, had no issue. Um, right down there where it says vendor coupon $2 at the bottom there before the digital coupons, she just went ahead and she entered the Borden coupons. They were $1 each. So she entered $2 so she wouldn't have to type it in twice since I had two of the same coupon. So that's why it says $2 there. But then we had our digital coupons for the Pebble Shakeups. We had the um, Pearl Mealing and we also had the General Mills. So our total was 8302 plus tax, and that was including the gift card. Store coupon savings, $11.10. 10 of that was for the $10 off with the gas card purchase. Then we had 1050 in manufacturer coupons and special price savings like buy one get one free and sale prices saved us 3936 today. So total savings of $60.96 right there. Now, with that being said, we went ahead, we submitted over to Ibotta. If you're looking at my total of 8302 and you subtract the $50 gift card, that means that all of the products themselves were at 3302. I submitted for $2 back on Ibotta because I was getting back a dollar for each of the Gorton's shrimp. And I wanna say maybe there was a bonus on that. I'll have to double check. And then I also got back $2 on the coupons.com app for one of the Thermacare because I used one paper coupon and then I claimed the other one on the coupons.com app. So after scanning in for those two easy rebates, it got my total down to $29.02. Again, not including the gift card. So $29.02 and I have 
have 24 items here. That puts me at about $1.20 per item. And honestly, going all the way from these products normally costing $93 all the way down to $29, I'll definitely take that, especially I added in a couple of items that maybe I wouldn't normally grab. Um, these clearance items, also the Propel, all of that. But definitely let me know in the comments below if you are interested in any of the deals this week, if you're going to pick up any of these same deals. I appreciate you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys!